Welcome to the 7724 demonstration. As you can see, that's the chip, the SH7724, and that's the dev board you can buy from Renesis. Have Ethernet to USB, SD card, DVI, uh, and, and much more different memories uh, to store your program or use them, different DDRs, different sound output, and, and pretty much most of the peripheral you expect to have on a dev board. Uh, as well, it also can come with a screen, as you can see here. The screen is actually can be attached on the dev board, and as we will show later on. As well, you can have two camera input, as you can see here. There's one in this side and one in that side. We already have one connected. And also a camera developing board as well. Now we're going to connect everything and take it from there. Hi. We're back again, now we have the TFT already mounted on the dev kit and connected to the camera. As well as you can see, you can see the camera as well, uh, probably not so clear in the video. And also the kit is connected to the PC. <coughs> Sorry. The USB is connecting, connecting the hyper terminal. So this is how we can actually control the kit and uh, run different applications on it. And the Ethernet cable that comes from here, as you can see, actually send video to the PC and we can just run the MSM player and oh voila, there you go, and this is me there on the video, I'm just gonna say hello quickly, now what's happening here is very simple, the camera of course uh, record the video and uh, send it in U422 to the dev kit, the dev kit used the 7724 uh, 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 how do you say, uh, video encoding uh, engine and encoded in 720 30 frame per second. After it's encoded, it also, uh, how should I say, uh, displayed it on the screen, on the TFT, but also send the information to the PC and then the PC here decode the video and present it in 720p graphic. Now, um, Yep, as you can see, the that's the dev kit, and now is looking at me taking a photo of myself. You can also see it on the PC as well. Uh, basically, the 7724 is uh, it's a Linux-based device. It's used 1.8. Uh, it's uh, sorry, its performance is 1.8 MIPS per megahertz, so it's very high performance, and it uses all the typical Linux drivers that you have in the market, and uh, basically. We are able to supply you some guidings and as well you can look on the internet and search for any advice to use those drivers as well. Now the reason the SH7724 is so popular is basically it comes from our mobile series that go to the big companies. I can't say a specific name but basically like Nokia, Motorola, um, all the big companies and, and they use this chip. The SH Mobile is is basically an industrial version of this chip so it's good for handheld devices uh, uh, video surveillance camera um, also it have a JPEG encoder and decoder on board so it's not just video H.264 it's also a, a JPEG and the JPEG can get to higher frame rate on uh, on video it can get to 720 up to 90p I think if I'm not wrong and this is yeah this is P that I mean that's a progressive scan I uh, just want to show you another demo, share with you. Here we have one camera. Basically the chip itself can connect uh, two cameras, as you can see on the screen. <laughs> two cameras uh, and encode them on the same time. But it cannot do 720p, it can actually do 480p. Which is not bad. Uh, in this demo, since we have one camera, it actually encodes the same video for three different streams. And it sends them through the Ethernet and the PC decode them and put them on three players so here we have a VGA uh, a D1 which is 720 uh, by 480 and 320 by 240 uh, this demo just show you the capability you see how smooth it runs and everything and uh, it's not a problem uh, this uh, unit can very easily decode sorry encode and also decode uh, two cameras on the same time and send them the data to different IP address or in this case sending it to the same PC. It all depends how you do your application. 
uh, sometimes it's used for home automation or mobile application which have two cameras I know most mobile phones today have two cameras so here you have it um, you have as well audio and, and all the other USB, Ethernet and all the other peripherals you have and uh, if you want to have more information on the kit and how to start developing your application in Linux uh, just ask your local distributor or Renesis um, representative Alright, that's me, Gil Coin here in ANZ, and I uh, hope to hear from you soon. Bye bye.